Um, my name is uh, Chris Sapua Gianni. Uh, I am the CEO of uh, a company called PC uh, Builders and I'm a stalwart of the BBC BE, uh, my, my organization. Um, yeah, yeah it's, it's very interesting you ask that question because um, I've been with the BBC more than 10 years now. We just came from celebrating our 10th year anniversary uh, three years ago. Uh, but it's important to let you know that uh, I'm a co-founder of the BBC BE um, with a few people that, uh, that came together and, uh, and started thinking we've got to do something about our industry. Your problem that you give to the BBC BE, you can be rest assured it will be, it will be followed up it will be uh, uh, sorted out one way or the other. PCB, which is my company, PC Builders, had a, an issue where we were appointed by uh, IDT to uh, go and uh, build a school in, uh, in Newcastle. And uh, IDT's offices were based in Devon. And uh, what happened was uh, that um, for some reason, IDT had uh, uh, expelled a contractor who was there before us who had done nothing. Uh, they were awarded this contract but then they did nothing about it and then it was forgotten because the client moved them off-site. Then they appointed us in an open tender because they went to a retender and they, they appointed us. When they appointed us, they then the, the guy who was appointed first went to court and won the case to be reinstated. So uh, then IDT came back to us and then told us, please move off site to get this guy because they've won the case. The question was, they won the case against two because they won a case against you, but we have been appointed. So they then thought, well, look, uh, we can just move away uh, without, uh, without any, you know, uh, reparations or something like that. But we came to the BBCBE, reported the matter, told the story. It took the BBCBE, even though it took a year or more, to solve that problem, but we were paid uh, our money, uh, our costs, and all that, and then uh, you know, uh, uh, and that was at the uh, the involvement and uh, of the of the BBCB. That is one major thing that I thought you know they did for us, and to really sort of, and it was incidentally the president of the current president, who happens to be a QS and a project manager, who looked at the contractual. Uh, side of things and says and said PCB or PC builders you're entitled to uh, uh, some sort of remuneration uh, just to cover your costs and uh, and other costs that were there. I think for me that was an eye-opener to say that uh, this organization um, you know has clout.